how much longer will and can Tom Brady play? Because Mr. Kraft has said that Tom's telling him he wants to play for six or seven more years. He's about to turn 40 on August the 3rd. So gut feeling from a man who knows him, how much longer do you see Tom playing? There's no end in sight. Mm. And that's the, that's, that's the truth. Hmm. Now, he wasn't always like that. When he was younger, you know, he didn't, he wasn't this health kick mm -hmm. guy. Now, he was a workout warrior, okay, but he wasn't like eating only this and drinking only this and, you know, doing only this stuff and, you know, having masseuses and everything else. But he takes care of his body like, like no one I've ever seen before. And he's totally evolved his whole mentality of, of about taking care of his body. And, I mean, as long as you're playing at the production with the production that he's playing at the level he's playing, everyone's way, everyone's rooting for him to fall off the fall off the wall, and there's no evidence of him falling off the wall. Tell me where it is. I think the thing that Skip wants to know is not how long can he play, how long will he play in New England? Well, I mean, how could you? How would New England let him go? You know Coach Belichick better. I know, I know that Coach Belichick, you know, everyone's dispensable. Dispensable. I got it. Okay, but, the, you know, this guy's a legend. I mean, this is Larry Bird. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is Bobby Orr. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is Tom Brady. I mean, um, I think, you Jim know, Brady's let's face Montana. it, Jimmy's not ever going to root for Tommy to get hurt. No, no. But the only way Jimmy's playing is if Tommy gets hurt. Okay, but they're going to have to make a decision pretty soon here. Well, they, it's an easy decision for the Patriots now. You say make a decision. There's no decision for the Patriots. You go try to sign them because you can't have enough quarterbacks. The decision really isn't the Patriots' decision. The decision really is to grab Lowe's decision. Because okay, but they can't pay him what I think Jimmy thinks he is going to be worth, certainly on the open market. Right. Well, see, Tommy yeah. takes that 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 discount because he's married to that Giselle lady. Yeah. You know <laughs> <laughs> well, it helps if your wife is making $40, $50 yeah. million dollars right. a year. Well, he's going to have to take a deep discount yeah. on this one. Uh, I remember when he goes, yeah, I'm making 20 She's making 50 I said, well, <laughs> okay. <laughs> exactly. So the other question about Tom going forward is, it, it's the one everybody faces, you face, when does the fire go out? In Shannon's case, he just got sick and tired of the meetings. Not the, the Sunday, but the meetings during the week. Do you see Tom's fire burning or raging the way it does for another five, six, seven years? Actually, I've seen it even be reignited even, even further. I mean, with, now that he's embedded into one area, he's uh, got his kids around him, and he gets to be dad and all that other stuff. He's not, you know, living the high life, flying all over the world like he was when you're single. Right. You remember now? I knew him when he was, you know, you know when when no one no one knew him. You know, his first his first year in the league, he threw three passes. I mean, I think he was one for three, and it was in the Detroit game for about six yards. <laughs> So the next year he goes, Drew gets hurt and wins a Super Bowl, and all of a sudden he must have got looking good looking overnight. <laughs> now, 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 now all of a sudden everyone wanted to date him. You know, so let me ask you this, Charlie. Did you know he would be this when you had him early on? We had a good idea. I had a good idea, but we, because I don't want to make it I, there's no I with the Patriots. Right. We had a good idea because what he would do in his rookie year, even though he wasn't getting any reps, remember, we kept four quarterbacks on the roster. Right. No one keeps four quarterbacks on the 53. We kept four because he was the fourth. He and wasn't even 13. If you played, if you released him and tried to sign him back to the Somebody, practice. Somebody, we would lost. Okay. So every day, at the, every day at the end of practice, he would take all the guys who kind of didn't do anything, okay, and go through the whole practice script. And you'd sit there and watch that and say, you know, who does that? Right. You know, practice is over. You know, Shannon, about half the guys are in the shower already. Mm -hmm. I mean. By the time the coach you know, says, all right. That's right. <laughs> there are guys jogging off the field already. Some guys don't even shower before they leave. They just go and. And, go and, and, and it wasn't just running through the plays. Right. It was running through the plays meticulous, you know. And you look at this and say, God, you know, he's got that something. Right. You know, and, mm -hmm. and a quarterback, let's face it, people want to talk about qualities in quarterbacks all the time. He's got this. He's got that. He's got it. Right. And it means more important than all those other things.